path of competition. Some of the Western world is scared of China for very good reasons. China is thinking outside the box, and here I'm going to make it very clear. Now you have a situation like Ghana. We have borrowed, we are around the 70% mark. It means that literally, if we want the economy to run smoothly, we cannot borrow any longer. We have a lot of raw materials in the ground. Raw materials, unless you put use of them, brings nothing to us. We have bauxite. Now, if I can exchange the bauxite, somebody comes to spend his resources to develop the bauxite into alumina, so that I use the alumina to pay him, that's thinking outside the box. I'm not borrowing, but I'm using my resources to create employment for the exploration and development of my resources. And after our meeting in China, when we brought, the Chinese brought this idea, the English were now interested. They now want to see if they can also go along the same path. Because if you don't go along the same path, people will do what is convenient to them. Ghana wants to create employment for its people. We have natural resources. We do what will support Ghana's economy. So yes, people are scared of China, and so there are all kinds of stories. But that's the competition. There's competition among the developed countries, and let them compete.